few years of recession growing. Uh, we've already seen some of the companies pulling back on hiring, right? We've seen one in five companies putting a hiring freeze. We've seen 40% of the organizations only trying to hire for critical roles. Uh, there's another 30% organizations which are saying that their hiring decisions require another layer of approval. So companies are starting to get conscious, especially in the second half of this year, uh, with all the fears of recession for uh, next year as well. Uh, so tide might turn, uh, but also let's not forget about talent shortages which the companies are facing as well. So I guess it's a fine balance uh, between uh, both of these uh, perspectives. Time-wise, when, when do you expect or uh, when are you intending to do that next uh, study or survey to find out whether uh, labor markets are untightening and, and unemployment is, is starting to bite? So I guess it goes back to that broader value proposition, right, which is uh, organizations are, can only compete so much on compensation and, and everyone's going back into understanding what's on employees' minds and trying to figure out based on that what uh, focus areas should they be working on? Is it going to be around benefits? Is it going to be around training or learning and development? Is it going to be about upskilling and reskilling? It's been a very strong agenda, especially as companies came out of pandemic, their business models had changed. They had done a lot more automation uh, than what it was before. They had done a lot of more outsourcing, which means that the skills required to be uh, deliver work might be very different. And, and that's one of the talk on employees' mind as well, that how do you help me upskill or reskill? And I guess that could be a differentiator for organizations trying to compete in this tight uh, labor market. Hi, I'm Emily Tan, and thanks for watching CNBC. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more. Thanks for watching.